EA Sports did something good. Is a is a is the sky gonna fall? It might, cause uh, this is the first time I've ever said that phrase out loud. I don't know if it's is that even safe to say. Guys, today we have an update to the all San Francisco 49er squad. If you guys did not see this last video, we are 50 at 50 San Francisco 49ers. The reason why I chose the 49er squad is because they get the most love by EA Sports. Yeah. EA loves this team. Obviously, they're one of the best teams in the league, but they get the most love in cards in general. And I would say that to a point that, first off, the upgrade we got today is Samsung right here. Samsung. Samsung right here, who is literally the free card you get from solo challenges. Part of Zero Chill promo. Shout out to EA for that. We got an 88 speed defensive end now because for some reason, EA will not give Nick Boza a brand new card. But not only that, I mean, you look at the squad we have right here, right? Richard Sherman, the fully maxed out version, I got to pick that up. That's, of course, a 93 overall. We have Dion, who's a 92 overall, I need to pick up. I need to pick up the left end, who's a 91. I can't get this guy, the one 91 over here, because it's an NAT card. And offensively, I still got to get Jerry Rice, and I still got to get... Um, let me double check. I still got to get Jerry Rice on offense... And that's it for offense. So defense, I have to get um, Richard Sherman, Dion Primetime Sundays, and Drake Jackson. But Drake Jackson is 300K. And then not only did EA Sports give us a free 49ers card here, they also made one of the two limited edition cards for this Zero Chill promo release one. Fred Warner. Yeah. Fred Warner is also a brand new card in the game who is one of the best linebackers in the game. So it's like EA just gives the 49ers cards. So if you want to rock the best theme team possible, just go San Francisco 49ers because you're going to get the best team possible. It's almost like to a, a joke at this point where it's like, hey, you want to go best team? Go San Francisco 49ers. And this card is so freaking broken. I just don't have 700,000 coins to spend on a middle linebacker at this moment in time. Because once I get him, he's going to have 94 speed. I have the plus three to zone coverage, um, you know, chemistry thing. So that's going to give me 92 zone. It'll be absolutely broken. And that's why, again, like I said, you got to love EA Sports because they just know how to give the 49ers cards. Every year, there's like one or two theme teams that just absolutely breaks the game when it comes to how much love EA Sports gives to a theme team. And this year, it just happens to be the San Francisco 49ers. So, again, like I said before, I also had to pick up Jimmy Ward. But he's a milli coins right now because all limited time cards are crazy value because pack odds suck. Hopefully, Series Redux comes out eventually. But I he got a card this season, so we're not going to get his card until next season. Thank you, EA Sports. You do, you take some W's, but you also take some L's. So my guess is, moving forward, we're probably going to not get a Nick Boza card until this uh, Ghost promo. He'll probably get a Ghost card. That would be my guess. Um, other than that, the secondary, I have some other guys from other teams in my secondary because you kind of have to if you want to run all-time San Francisco 49er squad. Because, for example, Ward's not getting a card anytime soon. Neither is Witherspoon, and neither is Isaiah Oliver. So, 49ers are an interesting squad. I think, wait, Rodney Harrison, he played for the Niners, right? Believe. I was going to say, you could put him at corner there. That could be something. But offensively, man, like, I still got to get this Jerry Rice. 1.1 million EA. Why are you like this? Just give us the ability, please. To actually pull limited time cards, man. Like, it's uh, just... Alan Robinson is 1.05 million. 1.05 million. 1.79. Puka, literally his blitz card, came out so long ago at this point. I mean, he's still one of the best receivers in the game, don't be wrong. But it's still 1.79 million. Because no one could pull him. EA does not. Pack odds, man, are absolutely trash. So, I, like I said before, guys, I am on the... I am 100% with 
uh, what's called the pack strike. I agree with it. I don't think you spend money on Mutt. I always say every single time, don't spend money on Madden. That's the number one thing I always recommend. Do not spend money on Madden. Now, do I think EA Sports is going to change anything and give us better pack odds? No. I don't think they're going to. Um, but at the end of the day, you know what? If you want to hurt EA and just take away money from them, absolutely do it, man. Absolutely do it. You know, go full on. Take away all the money possible from EA Sports because they don't deserve crap at this point. So, I'm hoping, this is what I'm hoping for, right? Chase Young gets a, a, a ghost card. I think he'll get a ghost of player's future or whatever that crap is called. He'll get a card. Nick Bosa gets a ghost card. Um, and I'm hoping, not maybe not future because he's not a rookie, but like of right now, he'll get a present card. He'll get a present card. And other than that, the rest of the secondary, I'm just going to hope and pray everything works out. <laughs> I'm just going to say it like now. I'm going to wait for Richard Sherman to come down to price because his 92 is ridiculous price tag wise. Even his 93 is still like crazy price tag. It's still 800,000 coins. I can't pick that up. And then Dion Primetime Sanders. Yeah, there's a 0% in any living heck I'm ever going to be able to pick up his card. His card is sitting around like 1.2, 1.3 million still. Um, EA, man, just, I don't even know anymore. They're not going to change anything, so it doesn't matter. Uh, but tell me down below your thoughts and opinions, guys, and which theme team are you personally rocking? Right now, I'm just kind of trying to take advantage of this Brock Purdy, getting this, you know, uh, Barry type of, you know, um, increase that's upgrade right now, because he's actually very, very amazing while he's getting the Matthew Barry upgrade, which is plus seven awareness. Which I'm actually kind of surprised he only goes plus three overall by getting plus seven awareness. I feel like he should get a higher overall increase than that. But also a little side note here, and listen, I'm not trying to complain in any way for this. But when he gets the Matthew Barry upgrades, right? Why is he getting plus two to catching and plus two to carrying? I mean, carrying, I guess, makes sense. Like right now, what's his carrying level? Um, His carrying is... Wait, am I stupid? Where is carrying? Change of direction. I see change of direction. Um, I can. You guys probably already saw it before me, and I'm being stupid right now. Um, well, all, wait, hang on, hold up, hold up. So those are his uh running stats: trucking 54, ball carry vision, stiff arm spin move 67. So I mean. <sighs> He doesn't really need plus two to carrying at 67 carrying. He doesn't need plus two to catching. And throw accuracy, I guess that's just overall wise, he's getting plus two. Yeah, he's getting plus two to throw accuracy across the board. The throw accuracy is nice. That's nice to have. But instead of giving us plus two to catching and plus two to carrying, can we instead, like, they should kind of cater those to the quarterback or whatever position gets the boost. So don't give me plus seven awareness i don't care about that crap that just gets his overall up ea okay don't give him plus seven to awareness take away the awareness and kind of spread it out so i would want instead of it being you know plus two to catching right take those two and give me plus four speed i want 88 speed okay instead of the plus two to carrying give me plus four to every throwing stat so 94 92 and 89 and then instead of the plus seven to awareness, which again does not matter for us as a player right now, because I'm pretty sure he doesn't even get certain uh, abilities that he would need to get this, I believe, right? Actually, we can't see because. Actually, no, 88, right? It's 87. They're tricky, man. They're tricky. But like plus seven to uh, take that and, you know, just do it across the board then. Do the same thing I did before with the throwing stats. Just give them like boosted throwing stats, crazy throwing stats. Plus seven awareness is so stupid. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts, opinions. I'll see you guys in the next one.